Hello everyone, this is me Sharon and in today's video I'm going to show you how to crochet this ear savers. Uh, you can use this for your face mask, especially when you have been using your face mask for a long time. This will help solve the problem when you have an ear sore. So um, if you have buttons and different kinds of yarn, this is really perfect because I'm going to show you different ways on how to make this ear saver with different kinds of yarn that you have. So I hope you watch until the end of this video. By the way, this ear savers have been requested by one of my friends and she asked me if I could make some of this ear savers because it really helps especially when you work as a frontliner and uh, your ears get sore because of using the face mask or wearing the face mask the whole day so this kept me up all night uh, trying to uh, look for ways and how to make use of the uh, scrap yarns that I have laying around in my house uh, Fortunately, I have some buttons too. So what I did is I use up the buttons that I have on hand and To start with our first design uh, This is very easy using your medium weight yarn and a 4.0 millimeter crochet hook you're going to start with a foundation chain chain 10 and then you're gonna add four more chains so the three chains there will count as one double crochet so after chaining 10 you're gonna chain four one two three four and then on the fourth chain from hook that is where you're gonna work your first or second double crochet because the chain three counts as one double crochet and then you will keep on working one double crochet into each stitch except the last chain Now when you finally get to the last chain, you're going to work 5 double crochets in there. So this will be the curved part of the oval shaped ear saver that we're making. And this is the easiest because we're going to work only in one round. So after working 5 double crochet into the last chain, this will turn our work into the opposite side and then into the next available stitch work one double crochet so we're gonna be working one double crochet into each stitch across and do not forget to not bury the tail in there because we're gonna use them to sew the button later Now, once you get back around, you will know that the last stitch is where we have the chain three and the uh, double crochet. So we already have two. We will add three more double crochets so that we're gonna have five double crochets in total on this end. This will be the other end. So we're like mirroring what we did in the other end, which has five double crochets. And then after this, go ahead and leave a long tail. And we're going to use that to sew the button on the other end. This will save time, especially when you're making a lot, so that you don't have to do it separately later on. So after this, you can just work another chain on top. So this is a technique to join the final round so that it will be an invisible one. So that's what I usually do even when I am working in circle. Now 
Now after this, you can now go ahead and add the two buttons on the other, on both sides. Just like this one. So this is where you're going to attach the straps of the uh, face mask. And uh, I will be using the uh, smaller needle so that it can get through the whole of the buttons. So if you don't have one, um, you can just use a sewing thread and a sewing needle so you won't have a hard time. Now our first ear saver is done. You can always adjust the number of chains if you want to make it longer. This one is about 3 inches or 8 centimeters. I made another with 4 inches or 10 centimeters. I added a button there and this one is a 3 inches and it's made of multicolored acrylic yarn. So this is what we're going to do next. We're gonna work two rounds, work in single crochets. Now to start, I'm going to start with 10 chains. You can make it longer by doing more than that. And then you can find in the next clip how I will be working on with the oval shape. And you might not hear my voice, but it's okay. I'll be showing you just how to do this differently if just in case you don't like using double cachets.
So I have ear savers that have three buttons so that it will be adjustable. And this one, you can also add one more button if you want. This one is made of cotton yarn, so it's a bit stretchy. Uh, the red or the maroon ones are also made of cotton yarn, but they're thicker. This one is acrylic yarn. It doesn't stretch, and if you ask me, I think um, cotton yarn would stretch over time, but acrylic yarn is more durable. But then again, uh, you have to wash this every time you use it for a day so that um, this won't catch virus. Because as we all know, we have to disinfect everything after being used in one day, especially if you are working in a hospital. Anyway, guys, thank you so much for watching. And if you're new to my channel, please do not forget to subscribe. Thank you so much. Bye.